Florida Vapors coming at you with another review for the Schwartz E-Liquid. Prepare to vape yogurt. So how y'all doing today? I know I haven't made a review in a while. I apologize to the Schwartz and I apologize to my subscribers and my fans. I've been working non-stop crazy. Um, haven't really had time to do these reviews and I apologize for that. So... Today, we are looking at the Schwartz. It is a 70-30 blend. Um, all of their, well, all three of their juices are yogurt-based e-juice. So they went the different route instead of doing a custard like everybody else does. Uh, whew, I have to sneeze. <laughs> Um, they went the yogurt route, so um, it's actually pretty damn good. The um, the upside, oh, this stuff is bomb. The upside is a smooth, creamy yogurt infused with strawberries, and that's what you taste. You get it's almost like eating yogurt. You get that creamy, like rich yogurt flavor like the thick flavor you get that as soon as you vape it and you get the nice rich fresh strawberries and then it's good it works so good the first kind of yogurt and strawberries I've had and it blows my mind how good it is and I regret not doing this review sooner because this this juice needs to get out into the world because it's good as hell so I'm using my box mod in series with 26 gauge Canthal 7 wrap. Comes out to 0.74. Bakes pretty nice on my uh, Mutation X V2. I like it a lot. So we'll drip this on here using some Japanese organic cotton. It works all right. I don't really notice big difference in between that and just some regular Walgreens cotton. So who knows? So let's take a vape. Fuck yeah, this shit's good. Vapes real nice, produces some sick clouds, thick clouds, the flavor is on point. So you really get that nice, rich, and creamy yogurt. And then on the exhale, you get just ripe, luscious strawberries that, you know, it's almost like eating the Chobani strawberries and yogurt. That's what it, exactly what it tastes like, and it's so good. I'm glad they went the yogurt route instead of doing like custards like everybody else does. You know, custards are good, but there's no like, you can't, it's just a custard, you know. You can add caramel to it maybe, but with the yogurt you can do so much more with it. And I think they got a really good start on it. Try it one more time just to get it through the wick. Get a little bit on my hands. Open this bad boy up. Jet life. Get a little juice spit up in my mouth. I don't really like drinking my juice. Sorry. Yeah, this stuff is badass. I love it. So, the other flavor they sent me is called the downside. And now, if y'all notice, if you ever watch Spaceballs, it's kind of related. See the uh, that prepare to vape yogurt, Yoda yogurt. You know, it's pretty funny. I think th this one made me <laughs> this one made me laugh. Comb the dessert. You know how in the movie they comb the desert and they get out there with the robots and they have a giant comb going through the desert. Shit cracked me up. So, the downside is a spot-on Greek yogurt topped with fresh blueberries. 
And you can you can really taste the difference between this as just like a regular yogurt and the Greek yogurt. You can taste the difference in between the both. It's pretty cool. And their hashtag is yogurt is the new custard. And I believe so. So this is the downside, which is a Greek yogurt and fresh blueberries. Now I've had some other blueberry flavored juices and the blueberries are always like an artificial blueberry, but with this one, it's like a natural blueberry flavor. Yeah. You get that Greek yogurt, almost kind of like a non-fat yogurt. Hold on. Yeah. You get that Greek, Greek yogurty flavor. Blueberries are spot on. Fresh, natural blueberry flavor. So like picking them right off the plant. Uh, yeah, plant, not a tree. Plant. Yeah, this stuff, stuff is damn good. I recommend it to anybody looking for strawberries and yogurt or blueberries and yogurt. This stuff is good. I can't wait to see what the next flavor they come out with because I know it's going to be good as hell. So, the next flavor is Comb the Dessert. It's a creamy peanut butter yogurt mixed with hazelnuts. Delightful hazelnuts. Delightful. Um, this one was pretty good. It wasn't too good out of the, um, got something in my eye. It wasn't too good out of the mailbox, but after a couple weeks of steeping, this juice really came alive. I mean, it's really, really good stuff. And these are all in three nick. They come in, um, zero, three, six, twelve, and maybe eighteen, I'm not sure. this stuff I like peanut butter vapes and that um, tastes just like peanut butter I like the yogurt I really I kind of taste the hazelnuts but not not too much that's kind of on the exhale kind of like a light hazelnut flavor but it's still very good yeah Vape it one more time. Really get the flavors flowing. Whew. A little fogged out in here. I'm trying to fog out my whole uh, living room. Not doing it in the usual place because the lighting sucks over there. So, I'm trying to get the best lighting, which is pretty good. You can see me and shit. Yeah, so on the inhale, you get a really nice creamy peanut butter, um, and then like in the middle of the inhale, you get the yogurt, and then on the exhale, you do get that hazelnut. Now that I've let it steep for a little bit longer, you really get that hazelnut in there now, and it's actually really good. Um, it's kind of like a roasted hazelnut, maybe. I kind of taste like a, um, a toasty hazelnut, um, but it's really good. Um, so that is my review for the Schwartz e-liquid vape yogurt. Yogurt is the new custard, which I think it is. Um, here is their, um, their card they sent me. Kind of leaked on some juice on accident. I got a lot of juice. But if you can see that, that is the guy's name, number, email address. Um, the guy's name is, um, Hi Nigen, maybe? It's a, 
Chinese, Japanese, Korean name. I'm not too sure how to pronounce it. I apologize to the owner of Schwartz that I cannot pronounce your name. Apologize for that. Um, they have a Facebook, which I will put in the links below. I'll put their Instagram there. I'll put their website, of course. You know, the standard. Um, but that's their Facebook down there. Their Instagram. And then their hashtag, yogurt is the new custard. And that's their logo up top. Um, didn't really go through the bottles, my bad. The bottles were really nice. They got their logo nice up there. You can see that. Um, the Schwartz, they got a nice bottle. Um, prepared to vape yogurt, the flavor um, on the side. They have their Facebook and Instagram. And on the other side, three milligrams of nicotine. They got a nice warning label. Um, and it says it may contain nicotine. And then they just have their ingredients. And not not for sale to minors. And they, you know, they have the standard uh, childproof caps, which are really nice. Nice droppers on them. I like the droppers because they do suck up all the juice all the way to the top. Some droppers, you do it and it only puts in a little bit in there. And um, it says they're out of Torrance, CA, which I believe is California, which is most juice companies are out of California. That's where it kind of started at. And yeah, pretty nice bottles for sure. I like them, how they look. I like the little logo they got. All around, really nice bottles. Really nice company. I want to thank them for sending me the samples so I could do a review. And y'all have a good day. Look for my new next review. It will be for Habitual Vapors. They got really, really good flavors. And I'm excited to do this review for them. As much as I was excited to do this one. So y'all have a good day. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to me. I'd appreciate that. And y'all have a good day.